these towers I go. Kind of fancy looking. Okay. Ooh, fire extinguisher. That could come out in pretty good handiness. Is there an accident here, or is this the black mask thingy? Yeah, okay, yeah. Dead bodies all around. Cameras. Gotta go here. There we go. I don't like this. What the? How kind of saw blade is that? You don't have a good kitchen, my friend. The police believe Penguin murdered Black Mask. But he... why would he send me here if he was the killer? Penguin didn't kill up. Black Mask, though. This crime took place days ago. The fire and the exposure to oh. the elements make identifying the victims difficult. The male victim is wearing a black mask, but I can't positively identify him as Roman Sionis without a DNA analysis. Nope, Something you can't. I can't do in the field. Oh. Wasn't expecting that. I can identify the female victim based on her fingerprints. Tiffany Ambrose. Tiffany Ambrose. Roman Sionis's girlfriend, or one of them at least. She was no angel. Long list of priors. Yeah. Nothing to indicate she was the target here. Mm-hmm. Okay. The fire spread as a result of a Molotov cocktail thrown into the room. Hey, is that the Oswald Cup of intended to destroy evidence? Nope, it isn't the Oswald Kubelpot. They say it was the Kubelpot. The shallow trajectory of the bullet suggests the shooter could be someone of Penguin's height. But the grooves on the floor suggest that the victim was killed by someone leaning back in a chair. This bullet was fired from a revolver. Ballistics analysis indicates a low angle of trajectory. Mm -hmm. The shooter could have been someone of Penguin's height, but the pattern in the gunpowder residue suggests the bullet was actually fired by someone lying on the ground. Uh huh. Fascinating. Hello? These fingerprints are a match for the penguin, but they're on top of the soot from the fire. The cops were right. Penguin was in the room. These prints prove he was here after the murders were committed. If he didn't kill Black Mask, who did? It was me. The only thing I know for certain is that Tiffany's shooter was lying on the floor. But why? What are you? These white streaks are shoe polish. Whoever shot Tiffany was being dragged along the floor. Besides the victims, there were two other people in the room. Tiffany's shooter and whoever was dragging the shooter. The location from which the male victim was shot may tell me more. Okay. The DNA here doesn't belong to either of the victims. Whose is it? The fight broke out when someone startled the shooter. It's not clear who won the fight. It could have been either one of them. And again, why is Tiffany up there? I should review the evidence to see if I can learn anything more about either the intruder or the shooter. There we go. And now detecting. Angora wool. Fabric analysis suit. indicates the intruder was wearing a white suit or sport jacket. 
This fabric swatch could help identify the intruder, but I still can't identify the male victim's shooter. There's one impact area I haven't checked for clues. Oh, never mind. This DNA is from the female victim. The level of oxidation suggests it's been here for several days. If I review the evidence, I may be able to find out what she was doing when she was attacked. Was she cooking? All right, and there we go. To rugs or phone. She was sending text messages to Roman Cyanus about Hurry, someone I'm scared. named the Joker. Who is the Joker? <gasps> someone killed Black Mask, but this crime took place several days ago, and I saw Black Mask earlier tonight. The only answers I have raise more questions. Who is the Joker? The origin is he story here, or is he one of the assassins? I'm I feeling body, stupid. It, the name's called shooter. Origins, and I just... And an I get away. To attack the yeah, shooter. that's fine. That's all good. I need to match the DNA samples against the records in the National Criminal Database to identify who was in the room. The room where it happened. I want to be in the room where it happened. Alfred, I need access to the National Criminal Database. Well, the only way to do that would be to infiltrate... Dark Knight Challenges. Let's see. Solve crimes. Connect Enigma thingies for a bit. Build a database, okay. Department. Then that's where I'm going. Sir, you'd need to physically hack into their servers. If you insist on doing something that foolish, Please. you'll need a powerful non-lethal weapon. I recommend coming back here to pick up your concussion detonator. <gasps> Not a bad idea. Concussion detonator? Ooh. Oh. That doesn't uh, bode well right there. Someone's probably gonna come right in here, and I'm gonna have to sneak out. Okay, that's saving, so... Ah, shit! Backup's gonna come eventually! Well, that works. Sorry. I apologize, so it's it's fine. I think. It'll be fine. You're just taking a little nap. Eight two. Perfectly fine. Come in, eight two. Dispatch, Delta four four. Can you raise Delta eight two? Stand by four four. Delta eight two. Delta eight two, come in. Delta eight two, come in. Delta eight two, report. Delta four four. No response from eight two. Please proceed inside and turn into status. All good. We're all good. Um, I did a bad thing. But that's okay. Uh, okay, yeah, let's... Uh, bucket prison. The cat cave. Prisoner's bridge. Um, what are these little thingies? We'll, we'll, close, we'll go to those in a bit. First... Let's go to meet, meet our main man, Alfred, back in the cave. Back in the cave. Back in the cave. Riding the bat and chip so I can go to the cave. Hey, Alfred, you got the car working yet? Because it would be nice if I could drive that thing down the streets. Welcome home, sir. The concussion detonator is on your workbench. Remember, if you use that instead of your fists, you'll do less lasting damage to those police officers and civil servants. Noted. That's a chamber. Oh! What is this one? Batman 1 million? Okay. Ah, uh, well that's pretty cool to use. I'm gonna just stick with the good old faithful. Um, where is my workbench, Alfred? Right here? Um, it's right here? 
Yeah, that's right here. Concussion detonator. What will you do? I could probably do these challenge maps later. If I want to. Oh! It's Bruce's hospital bed and a lot of other stuff. Oh. I don't need training. I can feel all I want. Fast travel onward to, uh... Where do I gotta go? GPD? The Bowery. There's a... You know, let's see if I can go to that point of interest, too. Who knows? Maybe. Just maybe. I can solve this enigma one, all, all in one go. But we never know. It's a thing that we just gotta go and do. What's with the loading thingy? Alright, uh... Okay, yeah, I'm just gonna head this way. Ooh! that to work, but it did. Alright, this point of interest is right here. Uh... There we go. Question is, is the question does Enigma HQ Enigma, where are you? I'm right here. Well, figuratively speaking anyway. But of course. Disappointed I didn't choose to meet up in person. What's this about? Sionis hire you to throw me off his trail. Think of me as an information broker. I've got data handlers everywhere. So you do all kinds of interesting stuff. And you think this is going to destroy Gotham? Oh yes. See, bullet wounds and broken bones will eventually heal, but incriminating photos, videos, emails, that kind of damage can never be repaired. Yeah, Tomorrow maybe. morning, when I release everything I've got, the city's going to collapse. Resignations, arrests, deaths, it'll be chaos in the streets, Batman, and there's not a thing you can do to stop me. Oh. Am I just gonna wipe the server? caveman on my equipment it's password protected I'm afraid with 10,000 volts of electricity you've lost Batman might as well head home and get some rest with everyone's deepest darkest secrets about to go on public display I've got a feeling tomorrow's going to be a very busy day for you that can't be good one way or another I'm shutting you down 
Destroying all the network relays will let me access his server. It's the only way to stop him. Oh. Those must be the handlers he was talking about. I can use them to track down the extortion data he's been collecting. Okay, so that's good to know on that. Okay, just so you know, I will be back. And when I'm back, oh, oh, the things I will be doing to you. I'll be back. I'll be back. I'll be back. Oh, Riddler, when the world is on its own, I'll be back. With a bad attack. Okay. Oh. Let's see. There's a handle right there. Interrogation time. Where is he? Man, I was this close to clocking you. No, you weren't. Get nothing but some broken teeth if you don't tell me where you hid the extortion data. I'll tell you where it's at, but it won't do you much good. I'll be back on my feet in an hour coming for you. Go no, for it. You won't. Okay, there's one of those thingies, and... Oh. It's Enigma thingy. Okay. Oh. That relay is destroyed now. Potential assignment incoming. Keep this channel open. Well, shoot. Plenty. Alright, 
Crime completed. Well, I saved an ATM. Does that turn that off, or...? Okay. Oh, he's on, that's why. Mr. Bruce, guards have been doubled at police precincts. Don't slow to matter. You'll need to find a way to sneak in. It won't attract attention. Otherwise, you'll never make it to the server room. Understood. Thanks. Okay. Not good. Okay. I don't feel good about that. Let's just keep going. Got eyes on the suspect. I have a good question for you, man. Do you want to live? You win, buddy. No. No. You get interrogated. You've got three seconds to tell me where you hid the extortion data for Enigma. You only have three seconds till the music starts, man. Three. Brandon and the boys will take you down. Two. Okay, okay, stop. Just stop. I'll tell you where it is. Good. Bro, she was gonna tell ya. You know, we... Uh, just start the music. Uh, yeah, wait, it was why. <laughs>